It's one thing for a man to have wandering eyes. It's another thing for him to have wandering fingers. Hey guys, Shandy here. It's been learned that John Travolta has been sued for $2 million by a masseur who claims the actor tried to have sex with him during a session. According to the suit, Travolta scheduled a $200 an hour massage with the masseur after seeing his ad online. He then picked the masseur up in a black Lexus SUV and drove to the Beverly Hills Hotel where he had a bungalow for his massage. During the session, the masseur is claiming that Travolta began touching him inappropriately on his genitalia, and when the masseur informed Travolta that he did not have sex with his clients, Travolta allegedly responded by offering to perform sexual acts on the masseur. The suit goes on to allege that Travolta masturbated in front of the masseur and revealed that his successes in the entertainment industry are, quote, due to sexual favors he had performed when he was in his welcome back Cotter days. Now look, maybe your method of massage differs from mine. He's also quoted saying, Hollywood is controlled by homosexual Jewish men who expect favors in return for sexual activity. After the masseur repeatedly turned down Travolta's offers, the actor allegedly called him a loser, paid him double his hourly rate, and then sent him away. The actor's attorney, Marty Singer, who was recently named as the top entertainment lawyer of the year by the Beverly Hills Bar, had some strong words for the accuser. Singer told Radar Online that the plaintiff will, quote, regret his actions and that he and Travolta plan to sue for malicious prosecution since they can apparently prove Travolta was on the East Coast on January 16, 2012, the date of the alleged sexual battery. Looks like we're in for a particularly nasty legal battle. Thanks for watching, guys. See you next time. I'm Shandy. And be sure to subscribe to ENTV for all your entertainment news first.